TP-Link Archer C6 setup. This is the best way to set up your TP-Link Archer C6 Mu MIMO Wi-Fi router. Connect the Ethernet cable from your internet service provider to the WAN or internet port on the back of the TP-Link Archer C6 router. Connect one end of the included power adapter to the device and plug the other end into a wall outlet nearby. Then power on your TP-Link Archer C6 router. If you want to reset and set up your TP-Link Archer C6 router, when your TP-Link Archer C6 router is powered on, press and hold the WPS reset button more than 10 seconds until the system LED becomes quick flash from slow flash. Then release the button and wait for the router to reboot to its factory default settings. Connect your phone or computer to the TP-Link Archer C6 router using an Ethernet cable or Wi-Fi. The default network name and password are usually on a sticker at the bottom of the TP-Link Archer C6 router. Once your mobile phone or computer is connected to the TP-Link Archer C6 router, open a web browser, type tp-link wifi.net in the address field, and then press enter to visit the TP-Link Archer C6 router's web management page. Please create an administrator password to manage your TP-Link Archer C6 Mu MIMO Wi-Fi router. First type your new login password. Then confirm your login password. Then, click on Let's Get Started to continue your TP-Link Archer C6 setup. Now log into your TP-Link Archer C6 router panel. Type the administrator password you have previously set. Then click on Log in to continue your TP-Link Archer C6 setup. Select your local time zone from this pull-down list. Then click the next button to continue your TP-Link Archer C6 setup. Select your connection type. Dynamic IP, Static IP, PPPoE, L2TP, PPTP, you can ask your internet service provider about your internet connection and the required details. I am choosing PPPoE. Then click the next button to continue your TP-Link Archer C6 setup. Please enter your PPPoE username and password given by your internet service provider. First type your PPPoE username. Then, type your PPPoE password. Then click the next button to continue your TP-Link Archer C6 router setup. When Smart Connect is enabled, the router's 2.4G and 5G networks share the same SSID, network name, and password. Without Smart Connect, a typical dual-band TP-Link Archer C6 router broadcasts to SSID. A 2.4G band SSID, and a 5G band SSID. Confirm or change the wireless network name SSID. Type the wireless network name SSID for your 2.4G band wireless network. Type the password you have chosen in the box next to the password for the 2.4G band. Wi-Fi password must contain at least 8 characters. Enter your wireless network name SSID for the 5G band wireless network. Type the password you have chosen in the box next to the password for the 5G band. Wi-Fi password must contain at least 8 characters. Then click on Next to continue your TP-Link Archer C6 setup. Scroll down for the Save options. Then, click on Save to continue your TP-Link Archer C6 setup. You need to reconnect your wireless devices to the new wireless network before clicking the Next button. To complete the installation process, connect your mobile or computer to the TP-Link Archer C6 router. Type the wireless network password you have previously set. Once your mobile phone or computer is connected to the TP-Link Archer C6 Wi-Fi router. Click Next to finish the TP-Link Archer C6 router setup and configuration. If you find this video helpful for you, please like the video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching this video.